Hi, my students. How are you? My students, uh, in the, uh, we are studying in the previous week. Subject, plants as medicines. Page 56. Plants contain many substances that can be used to treat illnesses. In the distant past, in the distant past, people used the leaves or roots of hundreds of plants as medicines. They used them to reduce fever, uh, or relieve pain, calm, upset stomachs, and treat other problems. About 40% of the medicines we use today are made from plants. For example, an important heart medicine called detiles is made from the leaves of a plant and quinine, which is used to treat uh, malaria, is extracted from the bark of a tree. One of the best known and most widely used pine medicines is also one of the oldest, aspirin. Aspirin is a medicine invented in the 1800s, but th uh, thousands of years earlier. People took an almost uh, identical medicine by chewing by the bark of the willow tree. Question, what did some people uh, do for palm before aspirin was invented? Aspirin is a medicine invented in the 1800, but thousands of years earlier, people took an almost identical medicine by chewing the bark of the willow tree. This is answer of this question. Other uses for plant is clothing. Clothing is another important product people get from plants. A shirt, for example, is made for of fibers from the cotton. The healthy cotton ball is made of tiny white fibers. The fibers are woven into cotton clothes, which is made into clothing. And what is the fiber? Fiber is any material that can be separated into thread. And soaps and shampoos contain the plant substance that can help make skin smooth and hair shiny. Example, uh, the leaves of the uh, aloe vera plant store for the food a jelly-like substance is used in soap, shampoos, makeup, and skin creams. And many perfumes are made from flower petals. It takes about 100 kg of rose petals to make 30 million of uh, fried uh, grounds. This is one of the reasons why perfumes are uh, expensive. Many kinds of trees provide wood for different purposes. Homes are often made of wood, and a lot of the furniture is most homes is wood. Musical instruments such as guitars, violins, and pianos are made with wood. And pop, which is made from wood, is used to make paper. Name two products made from trees. Homes, furniture, musical instrument, paper. Another subject, how natural materials are used. Page 68. Natural cycles, example, uh, nitrogen cycle, carbon and oxygen cycle, water cycle. These are included of the natural cycles. Many materials on Earth are used and then are used by living organisms. Example, store large amount of oxygen, nitrogen, and carbon in the form of carbon dioxide. Materials such as iron, copper, magnesium, and calcium are stored in rocks. And question, where do animals and plants get the material they need? Animals get material they need by the breathing and by eating. Thing, but animals release materials into the environment in their wastes. But plants get the materials they need from the soil and from the air. Plants release some materials into the environment during photosynthesis. The answer of this question just animals get a material they need by breathing and eating. 
a number to plants get materials they need from the soil and from the air? The answer of this question. Another subject, the nitrogen cycle. All living organisms need nitrogen. Why all living organisms need nitrogen? Because organisms need nitrogen to make proteins. To make proteins from nitrogen in the soil, animals get the nitrogen they need to make proteins when they eat plants or other animals that eat plants. Have nitrogen in the atmosphere, 78%. Most most organisms can't use nitrogen in this form. Nitrogen cycle, the nitrogen gas is fixed or changed into forms of nitrogen that plants can use. What are the two forms of fixed nitrogen? The answer of this question, nitrates and ammonia. And question, how do fixed nitrogen gas in the soil? Nitrogen gas by lighting. Lighting fixes a small amount of nitrogen, but most nitrogen gas is fixed by bacteria in the soil or in nodules, nodules on some plant roots. These are causes fixed nitrogen in the soil. And nitrates and ammonia are turned to the soil in two ways. What are the two ways? Number one, animal wastes. Animal wastes causes nitrogen and ammonia are turned to the soil. And another way, or second way, when animals and plants die, bacteria releases nitrogen and ammonia from the decaying protein. Do you see the change of form of nitrogen, change of form nitrogen for nitrated and ni ammonia, and fixed nitrogen by the bacteria in the soil are by lighting, return to the nitrogen ammonia to the soil by animal wastes and by decomposers another subject the carbon oxygen cycle the carbon oxygen cycle and oxygen move among plants animals and the environment all life on earth in, in, is involved in this cycle why all organisms uh, on earth is involved in the cycle because carbon and oxygen make up much of the bodies of all living organisms. The cycling of carbon and oxygen through the environment depends on two processes. Number one, photosynthesis. Number two, respiration. What are the differences between photosynthesis and respiration? Respiration is a process that releases energy from food, but photosynthesis is the process by which plants to make food and respiration take in oxygen and release carbon dioxide, but photosynthesis take in carbon dioxide and release oxygen. Fuelers over a million of years, the carbon in some decaying ocean organs turned into petroleum. Solar energy provides the energy for the photosynthesis in the plants. Combustion. Combustion oxygen is used in the burning of uh, combustion of fuels such as coal. Carbon dioxide is a byproduct of combustion. Fuelers dense forces once covered large parts of earth as these forces died carbon in plants become coal. And all uh, land organisms use oxygen or release carbon dioxide during respiration.
decay some carbon is stored for a while in the bodies of dead organisms bacteria and fungi break down the tissues of dead animals and plants and use some of the carbon as food the rest is released into the atmosphere as carbon dioxide but photosynthesis plants use sunlight water and carbon dioxide in photosynthesis plants release oxygen into the atmosphere as a byproduct of photosynthesis do you see respiration and photosynthesis the, uh, this process very important of carbon and oxygen cycle photosynthesis and respiration causes the balance of oxygen and uh, oxygen and carbon cycle what are the difference between respiration and photosynthesis photosynthesis the process by which plants use sunlight and carbon dioxide to make food but respiration is the process that releases energy from food Photosynthesis take in carbon dioxide and release oxygen, but the respiration take in oxygen and release carbon dioxide. Photosynthesis example plants, algae, some bacteria. But respiration, humans, animals, combustion, fossil fuels, decomposers use this process. But plants, algae, some bacteria use this process.